I'm Murray Ballard. I'm a photographer based in Brighton, and I'm currently working on one of the Connect commissions for the new Brighton Hospital on the theme of the South Downs. My starting point for the commission came from reading Robert McFarlane's The Old Ways, which is a book actually set on the South Downs. I guess that book really sort of changed the way that I think about landscape. It changed the way I think about kind of walking in the landscape, and he writes absolutely beautifully about the kind of process of walking and how it's something that humans have done since time began, really. And from there, I got really into the mythology and the folklore around the South Downs. What I decided is that the folklore might be my sort of starting point, because in the folklore, specific locations are mentioned, like Chanctuary Ring, Sisbury Ring, Mount Caburn, the Devil's Dyke. So I, I sort of used the folklore and the mythology as a way of guiding me to places. But then I perhaps drifted away from making pictures directly inspired by it and just sort of allowing myself the space to, to just be attracted to things for their photographic allure. The themes that come up in the pictures relate to the human impact and tourism and agriculture. I guess agriculture has had the biggest impact on, on what the landscape looks like today. David Bellamy refers to the South Downs landscape as being Europe's rainforest. But without the sheep grazing the landscape, there wouldn't be such a rich biodiversity. Some of my favourite pictures from this project were taken at Saddlescombe Farm. And um, it was very special to be there during lambing season, just uh, watching all these lambs being born with the landscape all around coming to life. I mean, it's special when you, when you witness it firsthand. Later that year in the summer, I was up on the downs above Kingston and I, I came across a field full of freshly shorn sheep. And the, you can see in the picture how dry and how parched the soil is. And I like the picture because it reminds me of just how hot that summer was. So the call-out for the commissions um, actually coincided with um, the time... Well, it was the time that my mum was uh, in hospital having a stem cell transplant. Um, she had actually been in and out of hospital for two years um, being treated for leukaemia. And uh, for the first time in my life, I was spending an awful lot of time in hospitals. I remember when... Mum was in Eastbourne Hospital. There were four or five Faye Godwin photographs on the wall. I'd go to visit and, and sometimes have to wait for quite some time. And so I'd sit outside staring at these sort of four or five Faye Godwin photographs, sort of pastoral scenes. And, you know, it's hard to sort of quantify these things, but having this sort of window to the outside world and to nature really helped. And, um, you know, it really resonated with me, the idea of using art to make the hospital environment a, a nicer place to be. And, and that's really the aim of this project. It's sort of this escape from modernity, and that's almost what I'm describing. I mean, it's, it's put me so much more back in touch with the kind of seasons and nature and, you know, at the moment I'm, you know, it's, uh, it's the beginning of April and I've been kind of going out a lot over the last sort of month and um, sort of two or three times a week. And I'm, you know, it's amazing just witnessing that landscape change. Um, and, I, you know, it's really changing quickly at the moment. And it's, for me, the project is about sort of, uh, yeah, I suppose reconnecting with sort of nature and, and I feel like that's quite a, that's, that's not a bad thing to try and bring into the hospital environment. It's sort of an antidote to the sort of clinical environment, the white walls of the hospital.